think I'd like this to be three tall and then the ceiling. So the ceiling will be the fourth layer. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I have uh, certain styles that I kind of default to. Whatever I'm building. Okay, this is fine because I'm going to have this oak wood here. I think I'm going to close this completely, but this can stay wide open for glass. And this has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So then I can split this. So that it has three on each side. So then one, two, three, boop, boop, one, two, three. There, and then the glass can go into these empty spaces. And then I can have, well, I'm gonna close this. And then I can have uh, this be the border for the food prep area. I'm gonna leave this open. I'd like this, you know, I'd like eaters, and customers, and visitors to be able to see where the food is made. Just because I think that'd be, well, nifty. Go there and there. It's fine. I like a well lit kitchen. I mean, who doesn't like a well lit kitchen? There. That's all done. I'll be able to put in glass and a ceiling and a roof later. <sighs> this place is really starting to shape up. This is going to go down. I'm tearing this down. And this I'm going to, well, make taller. And then I'm going to put a cap on it. And then I might put some decorative chimney blocks on the top. Uh, I think there's a thing called a smokestack that you can stick on top of a building to make it produce a lot of smoke and look like it's using a lot of fire. You know? It's purely decorative. So let me just see if I can find that here. Smoke. Yeah, the smoker. It's just redstone, well, redstone, a cauldron, and netherrack. I don't have any netherrack because I haven't been to the nether yet, but this is what I'm talking about. I can stick this in the middle, right above the foundry, and that will make it look like you know, there's they're smoke, so... I mean, it's not entirely realistic, but whatever, it's decorative. Let me have my fun. <laughs> okay. Uh, this can all come with me for now. I haven't even used this in forever. So I'll break this up. And I think I'm going to stick this in a workshop type setting. I might even move the foundry. Who knows? I just don't know where I want everything yet. So if you have any input uh, where you think I should put things, then let me know, because since the mine comes out here, I think what I could do is... Well, that's just sewage right there. I need to find something I can do with the sewage. But uh, since the mine's right here, I think I could set up the foundry um, here, maybe behind it over here, and build a workshop in this area. Because then I could have the mine come out. I like this lake, kind of. I mean, it's... Well, I guess I can always just dig out a new lake somewhere. But I have this mine here. I could set up the foundry here. And I could have it set up so that the workshop is right across from the warehouse. So, yeah, I think that would be neat. And then I could expand that, turn this whole area here into my living quarters, because then this wouldn't be here. I would have my food here, and I could probably focus on working on magic stuff here, over there, or in the area that is right here past the melons and pumpkins and stuff. I could have the magic area over here because it's right in the middle of a couple of nodes and there are a bunch of silver, or not silver wood, uh, great wood trees like um, this one and the, um, those things. Why can't I remember what they're called? Um, yeah, the, the things with the blue leaves. There's a bunch of trees like that over there too. 
And then I could set up a grove over there so that it could be farmland over here and then grove over there. But then there's that big lake. Hmm, I could have the grove behind the house too. I, c I could put stuff anywhere. Uh, Minecraft, everything is temporary, so... You know, there's that. Oh, whoops, did not mean to blow up my cactus. <laughs> And actually, I should move this cactus away from this little miniature herb garden thing that I have going on over here. And then just break this. Put the cactus over here. There. That way the cactus doesn't, um, isn't a danger to anything that I pop over here. There we go. And all this still has room to grow. Speaking of, I'm probably going to take all these small gardens that I have here and move them elsewhere because next to the mine doesn't seem like a very good place to have them just because you know and anyway I'm going to take whatever seeds I can get from these and put them in here and then expand all this farm out over that way which I think I'm going to start doing in a minute because <laughs> I've been playing recorded for about an hour and my voice is starting to get pretty tore up so yeah, there's that. Um, I hope you guys liked this. I had a lot of fun making progress and doing building stuff, and I hope you guys like how the base is turning out now. I feel like I've made some real progress today with this new building. It's not finished yet. The kitchen is being remodeled. It's not finished yet. But yeah, progress. Progress is good. I think um, while I'm expanding the farm, I'm going to go ahead and build some more of those meteor shields and probably a ton more torches just because I'm going to need to light this whole huge area to keep me safe and to keep my stuff from getting blown up. And I might even do a little bit more work on the buildings because I already have my plan. I already know what to do here. I already have an idea what I'm going to do there. In fact, I have a pretty clear idea what I'm going to do here. And then I'm probably going to strip this down and move it. So, But I'm not going to move this until after I've gotten some input because I don't know how I feel about moving the foundry right now since I will be able to just... I don't know. I don't know what I want to do with that foundry. It's an eyesore where it is. It's right in the middle of where I want my home to be. So, I don't know. I might as well move it, but uh, if you guys can think of a better place to put it than like right here or right where this lake is, let me know. Because eh, it could go anywhere. I just don't want it right there. <laughs> And I don't want it over in that direction, because that's the direction that my fields are going to expand in. So, I already made that clear. I'm, I don't want to move any of these pumpkins or melons. So, that's, that's what I have to work with. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. <laughs> Give me input, tell me what you think. And, uh, yeah. If you guys want to see more of my nonsense, you can subscribe. And if you want to tell me what to do outside of YouTube, say if you don't have a YouTube account or something, you can check the description below for ways to contact me outside of YouTube. And yeah, I guess that's it. I think I've been babbling for long enough and repeating myself for long enough, so uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye! Love you!